to Dave and Ryan in three, two, one. It's Dave and Ryan's movie review. Good thing in this world started with a dream. So you hold on to yours. I guess it's time to change the world. down here just got done seeing Wonka uh, this is a really it's a prequel story yep kind of tells you the whole ins and outs of how he became the chocolatier that we know and we love um, this one's gonna run you about almost two hours hour 56 minutes it's rated PG and it is a great family movie it, it deals with everything and I'm I'm just gonna jump right into this movie and I will be totally honest I enjoyed this movie a lot more than I thought I was going to. We have gone and seen movies this year, like when we went and saw um, Wish just a couple of weeks yeah. ago. I, I thought the songs in it were overbearing and unnecessary. I actually enjoyed the songs in this show. I didn't even realize that it was going to be a musical. And it... it well, it's, it's a Wonka film. There's mu musical... It's not necessarily musical, but there is musical numbers in it. There is, but it's... The, like, if you're going to judge it on uh, the Gene Wilder Wonka film, that it wasn't as musical as that one. This one's more musical than that, is what I'm trying yeah. to say. Yeah. Anyway, uh, Timothy Chalamet plays Willy Wonka as you follow him and learn everything that there is to know about why he did what he did, how he got to where he is. Uh, you'll notice there is uh, Keegan-Michael Key in this yep. <laughs> uh, with the ever-expanding waistline. <laughs> Um, Olivia he's Coleman got a sweet is in tooth. this. He's got yeah, a he's sweet got a sweet tooth. tooth. Let's just be honest. Olivia Coleman is in this one as well. It's, it's. I think it is. It's, it's, it's a family movie, just in time for Christmas. You know, yep. everybody. It's not a Christmas movie, but it's a movie that everybody during the holidays can go out and jump in the theaters and go see this yeah. one. It's a lot. Like I said, it's a lot of fun, and I enjoyed this movie uh, a lot more than I thought because. I'm just like, Ugh, do we really need this? Do we really need this movie? Dave's just a Debbie Downer. I kind of can be because I just was not impressed with the Johnny Depp one. I don't think I'm like, he, do we Johnny need Depp was Wonka impressed movie? with that one. Throw that movie away, okay? This movie, go see this movie. A lot of fun. I'm, in fact, I had so much fun. I'm giving this one four and a half buckets of popcorn. Four and a half, wow. I, and I'm interested to get your take because... I don't throw this around very often. There are certain movies that I do and a few movies that I say this about. This movie at times was beautiful. Yeah. And the colors, the everything was great. And I want to kind of get your feel on the take on that and the movie itself. Okay, so right off the bat, I gave this movie four popcorn buckets. So that's what I'm giving it. Like, like Dave said, this movie looks beautiful. You know, the cinematography, the colors, the acting, the, the choreography, everything about it was just amazing. There were a few times where I thought maybe it might be a little over the top. It, it kind of tiptoed that line, but it never crossed it. So if you're, you know, thinking, oh, it's going to be over the top musical numbers, that's not what this no, is. No, that, that's what I was trying to say when I was saying that they blend perfectly yes. into it. And you know what? I forgot to talk about Hugh Grant. Oh, <laughs> the little Oompa Loompa himself. It's the, it is. It, it was a fun time in the movie theater. It really was. It's two hours that didn't play like two hours. Yeah. And, and as I said, with the musical and with the song parts of it, they just flowed right into it. It's not like, oh, they're going to sing again. It's like, oh, okay, this is great. And I loved it. Yeah. I did. Now, now, if you like the original one, this one is not for your age graphic. You know, this this one is definitely for... I'm going to say uh, teenagers and younger. That's definitely what this demographic's for. You know, if you love the old, the original one, you will probably like this one too, but I'm just saying don't come in there with high expectations like Dave usually does. Because there are, there are certain throwbacks to the original yeah. and stuff in this. And, and if you're curious and you want to know, yes, you get pure imagination. You have to wait almost two hours for it, but you get that song in this show. And it works perfectly. It, it, it does. I it, they knocked it out of the park in this one. And I got to take my hats off to him because I didn't think we needed this movie. But it's a movie that I am going to highly recommend to everybody. And I think we did need this movie. Yeah. I really do. 
All right, so once again, before we get out of here, make sure you go like and subscribe. Find us on Facebook. Find us on YouTube. Give this a watch. Tell us what you think about this movie. Tell us what you think about all the movies that we've reviewed. Have we got it right? Have we got it wrong? Um, apparently, some of you thought we got the oath wrong. <laughs> I'm just well, going to put that out there. Those people are wrong. But I'm just going to put that out there. <laughs> but go and see a movie and go down to your local theater. This one deserves to be seen in a yes. theater. I think it really does. So until we talk next time, go see a movie.